Let's dive a little bit deeper into the action right now with our markets reporters. Abigail, get us started. Well, Romain, I'm thinking about those record highs that you're talking about. Take a look at this board. We have the NASDAQ, the S&P 500 tech index, and the SOX all at record highs. The common thread clearly is technology. Chips leading the way up for a third day in a row, up more than 6% over that time period. Today, up 3.1%. That SOX putting in its first all-time high since April. Texas Instruments really helping out, plus Teradyne, lots of other SOX. We, of course, have some marquee reports after the bell, Facebook and Tesla, and then tomorrow, Amazon and Alphabet. Alphabet. So what's next? Let's take a look at this longer term chart of the NASDAQ 100 and we see a beautiful uptrend out of 2016. Last year's chop on much of the uh, the fears around the possibility that big tech could be regulated plus Facebook's woes and last year's fourth quarter volatility. But there is yet another record high. One reason to think the strength can continue. Renita take a look at the RSI. We see a series of bullish higher lows telling you that the momentum may just remain bullish for a little while. But watch at some point for consolidation down to the 200 day moving average. Right now, though, it appears that tech and stocks pretty bullish, Renita. Abigail, another stock reaching another record is Chipotle, the food giant, Mexican food giant, which is reaching its highest since 2006. And this is after um, its previous record high of on July 18th. The earnings for the company were better than expected. Same store sales increased the most in two years and a 10 percent gain in comparable sales growth also helped out by the biggest year over year increased since the first quarter of 2017. Analysts say that this digital delivery menu innovation and stronger marketing fueled that same store sales jump.